j'ai euh, imaginé cette euh, onzième édition de la programmation satellite comme une exposition tricéphale, écrite sur la durée. Euh, le cycle est intitulé « Nove langues ». Il s'intéresse à une transformation de la langue aujourd'hui, une mutation de la langue telle qu'elle est opérée par le corps politique, relayée par les médias, par cette nouvelle agora que sont les masses médias, les réseaux sociaux. C'est une langue nouvelle qui se construit sur le néologisme, sur une réduction, une diminution des mots, et une langue évidemment diminuée euh, à des fins de, de non-individuation ou de réduction de toute pensée critique. Donc, tous ces éléments qu que l'on vient pointer euh, au travers de cette programmation ne sont pas sans rappeler ce que la littérature dystopique du XXe siècle a imaginé, notamment George Orwell dans son roman d'anticipation 1984. Il euh, imagine un gouvernement qui met en place une nouvelle langue, donc le, le nov langue, euh, qui se construit donc sur euh, ce réaménagement langagier. C'est une langue qui euh, efface une partie des mots. Certains mots n'existent pas, le mot démocratie n'existe pas, le mot liberté n'existe pas. C'est une langue qui se construit donc sur la régularité absolue, euh, un cheval des chevals, qui se construit euh, euh, d'une manière très binaire, c'est good, ungood, il n'y a pas de, 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 de distanciation. Et euh, le vocabulaire, lui, se construit euh, en trois classes. Et ce sont ces trois classes qui viennent euh, innerver les trois propositions des artistes invités. Donc la langue courante, la langue domestique, qui euh, est le, la clé de voûte du projet euh, proposé par Alejandro Cesarco. La langue politique, rhétorique, publique, qui vient euh, irriguer la proposition de Damir Oshko. Enfin, le langage technique, les termes techniques, qui sont à l'origine de la recherche menée par Daphné Le Sergent. Damir Oshko s'intéresse aux notions d'autorité, de, de manque, d'assujettissement, de désir. Il y a vraiment ce rapport de, du, du langage dans, comme, comme instrument, comme autorité au cœur de sa pratique. Pour moi, c'était vraiment really intéressant de venir au point, comme artiste, pour essayer de resurface the thinking of, uh, through the nonsense which we had in Dadaism and uh, early in the first half of the 20th century, kind of a tool of resistance into the social shift. Rooney, lawyer, stop. Rooney, red, yellow, peach, amber. Pilgrim, ribosome, orange, flamingo. For your film Dictature, you decided to make a research and work around the notion of safe world, which is a word uh, that is um, chosen, that will mark a situation, a relation between two individuals in the framework of a, a SM, sadomasochist relationship. What I found interesting in this idea of safe world is that it's marking a limit, the end of a form of violence, of pain, but it's also marking an agreement. Red, yellow, alligator, Jumaf, teacup, jelly, sunshine, beetle juice, 15, yellow, mayday, peppermint, pickle. The words that you picked up on various public forums, however they sound, in the end they all mean the same, stop. Can you explain us about uh, the film? To bring the anarchy into the language by moving the system and the structure of the language in with the way we know the language. So what we was really interesting to, to look at the, the result of how words or how um, Uh, particles of language behave uh, without the structure of language. In regard of the safe words which were collected, this was very interesting for me because uh, each word is different but it means the same thing. And uh, I always say that I have constructed a language which is uh, made of the perpetual stop. But also I was uh, thinking about um, the concept of safe word and the concept of the consensual violent relationships as a kind of a metaphor for the current state of democracy, you know, because you consensually participate in the, the social obligations and the political obligations of uh, you being a citizen, but in the same time uh, you are consensually uh, perhaps in the need of a safe word at times. Ketchup, Mayday, Alligator, Guadalupe, Green, 
Kapoor, okay. foliage, Stop. giraffe, bacon. The way the words are used here in the film is interesting and in the fact that they move from a meaning to uh, an action or a function or they, would you say they are kind of performative words? Or? I would say that every word in, in language is performative word because it means a certain action, it means a certain uh, either explanation or it refers to certain objects because it is uh, obviously um, also performed in a film through the means of uh, different cinematic tools and through the means of uh, a performance we're doing so the performability of it becomes really amplified. Fruit salad, taco, Justin Bieber, stop. They're just rehearsing, so when they come to the point of um, feeling that one of the, them is going to get uh, injured, they tap on each other and they also signal kind of a breaking point. So this was a really interesting point for me to have the, the presence of the safe word physically in the film, because it's not only the word. Yellow. We talk about co this collage of elements, the way uh, you work with the image uh, gives a, a feeling of um, difficulty to read the scene? By coming too close, uh, you disrupt what you see. And it's really interesting uh, process. It's a very kind of a metaphorical for the entire process, which also translates, as I said, in the language, in the word, in the performativity of the entire project. There are no subtitles in the film? The way the, the language behaves, it's, um, it's not uh, understandable. It's not a language that you would use to communicate to another person. Also, the words, the ciphers in particular, overlap with each other. They create some kind of a cacophony or texture, and sometimes they are understandable. And uh, by just being a code word itself. It's, it also creates, uh, the, the machine, the medium also creates a form of poetry. In exactly. A way. Refrigerator. Helicopter. Fidelio. Lactos. Tesla. Schrödinger. Jumanji. Schrödinger. Bananitas. Schrödinger. Bananitas. Schrödinger. Red. Schrödinger. Chiffon. Button off. Crumpet. Oppenheimer. Franz. Markovic. Mary. Dumbledore. Darkwa, Gandalf, Red. Montezuma, Hemoglobin, Spinach, Teacup, Bazinga, Jellybean, 